Welcome to this week's Subculture. <laughs> yeah, I'm your host, Lou, with my co-host, Natasha. This ah, week no, 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 uh, 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 uh. I'm your host, Natasha. It's my co-host, Lou. Okay, um, whatever. Anyways, um, <laughs> welcome to this week's Subculture. Um, we have our weekly <laughs> show about videos, current events, and what the going ons are at Cornell University and the Ithaca community. Um, we're doing a little thing called, you ever seen the McLaughlin Group? Well, I think we should do something called the Silvers Group. So I'll be your moderator, Lou Silvers. Now, issue one. Oh, God. <laughs> Pedophilia. Help us. Help us. Crime of passion. Oh, we got a phone call. I never yet to that McLaughlin group thing. Oh. Hey, what's up? You're on Subculture. Hi. We're Harley and Dave. They... I thought Harley and Dave were the hosts of this show. No, it's Lou and Natasha. Didn't oh. I just tell yeah, you that? Yeah, yeah. Since when? Since, like, about <laughs> 30 seconds ago. Oh, are Harley and Dave going to be on next week? I don't know who they are. What is up with this Harley and Dave business? I can't deal with this anymore. Who are these people? And who, who, are, who, 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 who are I think are they're the people? regular hosts. Oh, I've hosted this before. I could be a regular host. They could have been something oh, I don't know. I've me. been watching the past couple weeks, and, and they've been on every night, and they're pretty funny. Oh. Not that you're not funny. Yeah. Just, you know. I mean, it's been like all of 30 seconds, you know. Yeah. I don't know. I'm kind of in the Harley and Dave mode. Oh, you know? I'm sorry, but they're not hosting this week. Enough about Harley and Dave. <laughs> they're not hosting this week. So, issue one, pedophilia, <laughs> crime, or <laughs> acts of so passion. Awful. Well, we're going over to you. No, it's not acts of passion. It's sexual creativity. Sexual creativity. Oh, well, you're the one who was in this class, so. Yeah, yeah, apparently it is, uh, it is, it is new to me. Uh, um, apparently there is this view out there that, um, Pedophilia is a, an act of expression, and children are naturally sexual creatures, and, and adults try to... Uh, Would you define to... Anna Kornikova, the famous tennis player, as a child? She's 17. Okay, she's 17. It depends. It depends if the man is 19 or, like, 35. Well, she's dating Sergei Fedorov, and he's about 33. Okay, Absolutely. see, that would be illegal. What about with me, and I'm 21? If okay, me and, me and look, Anna hooked Lou, up. we've established that if you and Anna hooked up, it would be, like, pedophilia. Why, why is that? Because you were, you, were, you were a man. Lou, you are <laughs> such a man. And but Anna Kornikova is all of it. Is 17 years old. No, she's a piece of ass. <laughs> okay, I know you didn't just say that because that would be, <laughs> that would be really unattractive. But, um, but, but she's 17 years old, uh. and, and, I mean... Even though the woman plays tennis and whatnot, and she like has this experience with balls and what, I still think that there's this certain like 17-year-old innocence and naivete that that one could not protect themselves from you, Lou. No, Anna Kornikova. I think Anna Kornikova is very innocent. I think Sergei Fedorov broke her in, and uh, <laughs> I didn't mean to say it like that. I mean he kind no, of. No, uh, you meant exactly <laughs> to say it like that, and everybody understood <laughs> you to say it like that, and that's just you've said uh. it. I meant now he, he's uh, broken her in. There's he room jaded, for He jaded. He quote unquote jaded her. He jaded her. Yeah, that's what I meant to say. Do you think they do the lap dance? Anna Kornikova. Yeah. I, I don't know. I wasn't there. I don't they, know. They they're from Russia, so maybe they're like. For any of you. Oh, we got a phone call. Oh. What's up, subculture? Hey, what's up? Hey. How's it going? All right. Yeah. 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 Who what is you, this? What are you up Wait, to? Wait, who is this? First of all, I need a name. Yeah. What? What's? What's your, what's name, your name, Mr. Caller? <laughs> My name's Jimbo. Hey, Jimbo. Jimbo. Like, yeah. And I got a girlfriend. Uh-huh. She's a bimbo. Really? So it's Jimbo and bimbo. That's really kind of cute. Yeah. Kind of kinky. Is she uh, hotter than Anna Sounds Kornikova? kinky. Sounds very kinky. Yeah, it, it definitely is. Yeah, so what's, what's your question? What's my question? Uh-huh. How, how did you get on TV? Um... Was there an audition, or yes, we, did they just take you because well, of your natural talent? Um, well, they know of our na well, the natural talent was part of the audition. We auditioned with, uh, with about 300 other... Can other... you speak up, please? We auditioned with about 300 other you people. You don't have to shout. And uh, we were chosen as the, best <laughs> as the best people among those people. Yes, it was a very selective, very yeah. selective process. Um, thanks for the question, Jimbo, and say hi to Bimbo for me. I think it was Nympho. Oh. Nympho. Yeah. Whatever. Whatever. Anyways, what were we talking about? That, that caller was just going nowhere. I don't know. It's all about going nowhere. It's all about the Benjamins. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you leave the greens out of this, all right? 
Oh, we got another call. Oh, this is good. What's up, subculture? I, I was not going nowhere. I resent that comment. <laughs> <laughs> now you have nowhere to go, my dear friend. Yeah, don't mess with Natasha. Just she don't. She, she doesn't I'm like. I'm so sorry if I'm like not here, but I'm reading this Cosmo, and it is it's fabulous. It is fabulous. Oh, things well, you can learn. What what the do they talk about this month? We're we're talking about the fifteen. I mean, I don't know how appropriate this is for our younger viewers. So, um, it, like caution, parental discretion is advised. This program is rated M A. Yes. <laughs> Mature audiences. Mature audiences only, and what's her face? Tennis woman, like, not included. Um, it's the Cosmo Kama Sutra, inspired, the a a inspired by ancient love techniques of the Far East. Here's Cosmo's 1998 Oh My God Guide to the Art of Sexual Ecstasy. And the shit they have in here, sorry, excuse my language. The stuff they have in here is like, it's ridiculous. It's like, uh, well, that's what, that's what the Kama Sutra is about. It's like exotic. And it's exotic. beyond exotic, though. This is like, you need to do like 18 years of yoga to even like, become even remotely flexible like well, this. It's for gymnasts, I think. And, uh, oh, we got a phone call. Tennis players. Oh. Gymnasts and tennis players. Oh, we don't have a phone call. <laughs> I'm just not on the ball today. I'm sorry. That's, uh, <laughs> what's with you and your balls, Matt? First you got your tennis balls, and then you've got your, <laughs> I don't know. All right. Um, <laughs> yeah. What's so funny, man? <laughs> okay, here's the great title. Are guys all crotched? I don't know. <laughs> Is yeah. he a caring cutie or a carnal cad? Ah. <sighs> Um, America's yeah. population, America's youth. Look what's look what's becoming of us. Besides this week's Cosmo. Oh, we, we should go to a video right now. That's what that's what I think is a good time for. So um, are you cutting me out for a video? Yes, I say I am. Mm -hmm. um, so we're going to a video, and we'll be back in a few minutes. Subculture here. If you want to call in, two seven two three eight three five. Give us a call. Let us know what you're thinking. What's yeah. going on? Bring up some great topics. Whatever you want to talk about. Complain. Clinton. Marijuana, Cornell, pedophilia, boys, boys girls, girls the Kama Sutra, the Jets beating the Patriots on Monday night last week. No, no, no. Anything you want to talk about. Yeah. I have my plug in for the J E T S, Jets, Jets, Jets. So sweet. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> any, oh, phone call. Hey, what's up? You're on subculture. Hey, what's up, man? Hey, what's up? What do you want to talk about? This I was week? wondering if you guys do requests. Request. request. Um, we only have a limited for videos. Yeah. We only have a limited video library. But oh, really? Do you have any 311? Well, 311. Do we have any 311? I don't know. If they have 311, we'll play it. Anything else you want to talk about? Nope. All right. You sound a little down. Yeah. What's wrong? Uh, nothing really. I'm just chilling, bored, watching videos. Are classes getting you down? Nah. Are, is Bill Clinton getting you down? What? Bill Clinton? Are you yeah, upset Bill about Clinton's the state up. of the presidency? He's a faggot. Bill Clinton is not a fag. If he was a faggot, would he be getting a blow job? Yeah, well, that's his cover up. Bill Clinton's oh, good. Oh, who do you think his lover is? George Stephanopoulos? No, Al Gore, of course. Al Gore? Al Gore's like, I'll give you a blow job. You put me in office. I don't know about that. I yeah. think, uh. You know, yeah. That's not something I like to think about. Yeah. Al Gore, I don't know. I guess he, his wife is Tipper Gore, and like, I wouldn't, nobody would touch her with a 40 foot dildo, so. Nobody would touch Clinton's daughter either, but. You know. <laughs> I mean, like the the lead member of Hanson. That's Clinton. That's Clinton's daughter. Oh, really? Yeah. You can't, don't you ever see the similarity? You never see. Have you ever seen? Actually, both I of think them? the uh, singers from Hanson are much cuter than. Well, the oldest one. Yeah. Do you think? Um, I actually thought they were chicks when I first saw. Yeah. Them. Well, we did you think? Have you ever seen Chelsea Clinton and oh, the God. oldest member of Hanson mm -hmm. in the same place? No. They're, they're the same that's, person. Yeah, that is the answer. Must be. Yep. All right. Well, anything else? Nope. I don't. Well, that was that. Turned out to be a fairly decent call after Not a slow beginning. Not too bad. You know, um, that's an interesting um, conspiracy theory that Bill Clinton is gay and he's doing this as a cover up. Oh, we got another phone call. Hey, you're on subculture. <laughs> Yo, what's up? My name is Ronnie. Hey, Ronnie, hey. how about turning down your TV a little? Oh, uh, okay, hold on. How do I turn down my TV? <laughs> um, mute. How about that? You, I, I, hold on. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Ronnie, you there? Yeah, yeah, I'm there. I'm there. Hey, what's How up? How you doing, Ronnie? Pretty good. Yo, I just wanted to know, is there anything going on with you? Me and Lou? Yeah, you and Lou, right. No, you and the other guy on the show. Yeah, you and Lou. What, what other guy? Well, that, 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 yeah. <laughs> what? Oh, that was a joke. <laughs> oh, that, that other well, Ronnie, guy. you know, next time you, like, crack a joke like that, you're going to have to, like, give us a little warning. Huh? He's pretty slick there. Oh, yeah. oh, guys, I was just trying to make conversation. 
That, yeah. that, that's really nice of you, Ronnie. I'm sorry. Ronnie, what's going on with you? How are you? No, pretty good. What's going Yo, what's the topic of the show? I just turned on. I saw you guys on TV. And I have no idea what's going on. I just called. There's really no topic. Yeah, it's what, about what, what, do you, what do you want what to do talk you, about? What, what do you want to make some It'll be like Ronnie, Ronnie's, Ronnie's few minutes here. Yeah. Oh, all right. I just want to know if you want to meet at dinner. Okachos tomorrow at 7. That's the only reason I called. I'm on a meal plan. Oh, screw you, Lou. I, okay. I was Wait, what was that? Yeah, I just want to know if you want to meet at Willow Street tomorrow at 7. Oh, oh, oh at night? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, that's the only reason I called. Well, what was the last video you showed? It was really bad. What was it? Tori Amos. Oh, God. Do you guys have any sublime? Yeah, 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 we do. We, we do. do. Keep watching. It'll come up soon. Sooner okay. Or later, it'll it'll be, be Ronnie's request. Yeah, I made that Ronnie's request. Okay. Okay, I'm going to let you guys answer some more phone calls now. All right. All right thanks, Ronnie. Thanks, All right, bye. Thanks Take for, care. like, totally dissing me. <laughs> I don't know. He asked me out for, for dinner, and then, like, he really didn't, you know? Well, you know, I, I mean, what do you say, you know? Yeah. I, I'd like to be bonus in one of these. Oh, we got a phone call. You're on subculture. What's hey, up? Yo. Hey, Hey, that Tori Amos video is awful. What's she doing playing techno? I don't know. Uh, I, I don't I've know. never been a I'm big, not a big Amos, fan. Amos fan. Yeah, know? good. I'm we don't we don't choose the videos. We just, we I, just I, I, I chose the videos. You don't pick the videos. Like the doors. No, like, no. We, uh, we, we don't have that much power. I mean, the video was kind of cool looking, but that was the lamest techno I've ever heard. It's one of those things you want to watch in mute, it's like, huh? Boom, yeah. Boom, yeah. Boom, totally. Yeah. It's all about. It's all about oh, the no, music. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! You know. I I hear you, man. All right. Do you have any good techno? I don't know. What, no. what, do you, what do you consider good techno? Oh, like Aphex Twin or um, Orbital, that sort of thing. Yes, we have some Orbital. Yeah, orbital we have. play that. Nick says we have some Orbital. All right. And, uh, yeah, so keep watching. You ever watch the Dukes of Hazard? Yeah. Oh, Isn't that awesome? That rock. <laughs> Just the good old boys. They got, like, one shot of the car jumping over something. That's all you need. No, they, yeah. That's all you they need. They always stop the show when it's jumping over, like, the river. And they're like, we'll be right back. Right. That one, all right, that cool. One. All right, thanks for calling. He brought up, well, actually, I brought up, Dukes of Hazzard is the best show ever made. Yeah, uh, yeah I'm All with the you. ingredients. No, no, and the A-team the A-team kind of kicked, too. No, I like the Dukes better. No. Daisy Duke was up. Oh, we got okay. a call. Hey, what's up? Subculture. Hi, this is Bill Quinn. Oh, God. What's Hi. up? It sounds like you have a sore throat, Bill. Have you been giving a... I've been giving a lot of speeches. I, I can't help it. You know what I'm saying? I can't believe Bill Clinton is watching this we show. We rock. I can't believe we made it all the way to the White House. You know, we have a special satellite dish in the White House that, cool. that gets, you know, public access, and I just love your show. How come you're not getting a blowjob right now, Bill? <laughs> <laughs> Hillary, quiet down, please. I didn't uh, know you slept with Hillary. Well, no, what is this? What happened to, like, your no, <laughs> Hillary's also named my dog, so. <laughs> what? Oh. That was beautiful. I thought his name was, was Buddy, beautiful. but I guess you got a new dog. I haven't been keeping up with the news lately. What? Um, so, um, I heard you've been giving the cigar industry a good boost lately, Bill. I, I try, you know. Yeah. I, I don't only smoke them. I use them for other purposes, That's which yeah, we need not get into right now. Clear, Bill. Excuse me? I said that you made perfectly clear. Yes, so, so but Bill, we, we need not get into such things right now. You know what I'm saying? Bill, why, why is your daughter so butt? That's what we want to know. Why is she so buff? Butt. Like, butt. Uh, well, you know, <laughs> Hillary's side of the family has very weak genes. And so, you know, if, if she had more of my genes, I'm sure that she'd be quite a, a looker. But I, <laughs> I might even, you know, want a piece of that. But we're not going to get into that right now. Right, right. Yeah, but you are from Arkansas, so it would be accessible to see with your daughter. You know? Well, no, because she's <laughs> over, she's Arkansas, over yeah. 18 now, so it wouldn't be as oh, accessible. Oh, so, so it would be pedophilia, not, not incest in Arkansas. Right. Right. See, we're trying to cover all, all the issues right now. Trying to cover all the issues. Cool. Thank yeah. you for calling, that, Bill. No nope. problem. I, I say hi to my friends in Washington for oh, us. Da, da, you, you say da, hi to Monica da, for da, us. Da, 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 da. Send Hillary our love. Wow. <laughs> that was that was uh, that was I I don't know. Hail to the chase. I'm just really flustered right now. Wow. The president of these U.S. of A. states has called in. <laughs> wow. We're in awe here. Oh, another call. Oh, another phone call. Hey, what's Hello. up? Hello. Hello. Uh, this is Harry calling. Who? Uh, Harry. We just wanted to know uh, what is the uh, nationality origin of Natasha? Uh, well, sir, I can tell you this much, that I am from the origins of India. 
Oh, is it? Oh, we just were having a bet. We wanted to know whether, like, we are right or wrong. I mean, we 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 are like thinking whether it's from India or the Eastern Europe. Oh. Yeah, that was okay. Thanks a lot. Now, no, can you please play uh, Aqua Barbie Girl for us? Do we have Aqua? I don't think we have Aqua. Okay. Um, we might. They're gonna check our video library. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Goodbye. Well, goodbye. Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah. This is good. We got Sublime. Um, are we going to a video? We're going. What? Yeah, yeah we're going video. to a video. Time for a time video. For some Woo -hoo! Sublime. Yeah, yeah. Subculture two seven two three eight three five. Give Please us a call. Give us we a want to hear ring. from you. Yeah, uh, I got a little promo here. Um, Big Man on Campus is on campus at Cornell oh, this we week. We got a call. Sorry. And all right, we'll do that later. Hello. Hey, what's going on, guys? Hey, Nothing what's up? Much. Uh, I just want to give a shout out, a little ahoy ahoy to my boy Mike Klein. Mike Klein. Mike Klein over Valentine. He's watching. I know he's watching. Okay. Yep. Hey, so, uh, yeah. Well, uh, I don't know. Uh, Sublime. I'm not really too sure about the good video thing. I like that. That's a good no, video. No, no, that was not so bad. I mean, compared to the first one. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's We're true, doing that's good. True. Yeah, that song was kind of played out a few years ago, but it, it's still pretty good. That's true. Yeah. So, what, what would you like to talk about? I don't know. Uh, let's talk about fish. You guys like fish? Fish. Fish like pH. Fish hey, or yeah, fish yeah, yeah. Like eating fish. Like, like yeah. pH or F? Like uh, fish. Like pH, yeah. Fish? Yeah. The band? I don't know. I don't I'm know not a. I'm not a big fan. You guys don't dig them? No. No. That's all right. That's all right. 
All right, you guys keep doing what you're doing, all right? All right. Later on, man. Big man on Thank campus. Of a lot of characters. Yep. Big man on campus this week, um, tabling in front of Willard Strait Hall, Trillium, Noise, and RPU. Um, donations go to the American Cancer Society and to the victims of the Collistown Fire. It's a just, great cause. Yeah, and you vote for whoever you want to win, and you just throw in change into the buckets, and it's a good cause, and it doesn't take too much money, and every little bit helps. So you'll see them around campus this week if you go to Cornell. So donate. And if you don't, make a trip up. It's worth yeah, it. it's, worth, it's worth it for a good cause. And that's my little shout-out this week. To, um, big man on campus. Give us a call. What is the number, Lou? 2723835. Um, oh, here we go. You got another call. Hey, what's up? <laughs> Hi, how's it going? Hey, Not what's up? Oh, uh, good, good. You guys are looking good up there. Thank I'm you. So proud. It's great. I just have to say that the guy who just called like, has no idea what he's talking about. I know. Symphony, yeah, that song, like, rocks. It's such a happy song. Yeah. It is a happy song. It's about drinking Sorry. and guns and, like, Lou no, Dog. No, no, no. <laughs> Dog yeah, video? that's my. That's gonna be my new nickname. Was that beautiful or what? Lou Dog. He named it after me. No more Captain Lou. We, we can start calling you Lou Dog. I like Captain Lou. <laughs> what do you think about that? What do you think we start Lou? calling Lou Captain Lou? Captain Lou Dog. <laughs> that's good. I like that. Too. We salute you, Lou. Oh, look at that rhymes. <laughs> 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 oh, okay. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> what are you reading there, Natasha? I'm reading this Cosmo, and I mean, Lou is absolutely like not interested, but I think there's some really, like, liberating things in here. No, no, no. Guys like to read those, like, by themselves. I know. I'm I like you. to read it in the bathroom uh -huh. when I'm by uh -huh. myself. You know what I'm saying? You catch my drift? I, 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 I totally. <laughs> it's all about the loose salute, huh? I like but, that. Uh, but, no, there's, there's some, like, pretty fascinating things in here. Oh, there's and good I mean, stuff in there. It's, it's worth, it's worth giving, it, if, giving it a chance. It's worth the $4. It's Definitely. A good, it's a good magazine. Too. This is 4 bucks. It's $4 fucking dollars. I don't know, four dollars is a little steep. A little steep, but it's, it's a thick magazine. It is pretty heavy. Yeah. There's a lot of like literature in You'd there. You probably get a subscription, it'll be cheaper. Yeah, probably. <laughs> See, I'm not that smart, you know. I that's, go here. here. That's where my stats education is coming in. That's oh, yeah? See, math stats. is not for me. No, no. no. We're, we're not about math, are we? No, we no, are not. No, no. You're just about the no. Benjamins. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta leave, you gotta, I'm telling you, you gotta leave Ben out of this because, you know, it's, yeah. it's not about Ben. Ben? Benjamin, you know. Oh, the ben, Benjamin. Yeah. Ben, ben Don't Jover. know about those. Me and Abe. Me and Abe are good. Abe? That's about it. Yeah. He, no he wears a funny hat, huh? Oh, I yeah. Mean, I don't know much about this American history of yours, but <laughs> I just know Abe wears this big white beard and a funny hat. No white. Come on. He was like, oh, he died young. He was always like brown. When they put him in the no house white. and he's singing that little, like, I'm a Yankee Doodle Dandy, he's wearing a white <laughs> That's beard. That's Uncle Sam. What, what are you talking about? Uncle Sam. Little Sam. Not Abe. I'm a Yankee Doodle. You know, like that. Uncle Sam. Oh, uh. I don't know. You're I, obviously Canadian. All I know about American history, I got from Full House. So, you like, and your maple leaf. Full House. <laughs> you leave me and my maple leaf out of it, all right? I represent. Don't they have the Dukes of Hazzard in, I don't know, in Canada? That. Yeah, we have the Dukes of Hazzard in Canada. Oh, the Dukes. You should be watching that instead of Full House. You know what we have in Canada that you don't have here? What's that? It's that little purple elf. What's his name? We wouldn't know. We don't live in Canada, honey. <laughs> Canada, yeah. huh? The little purple elf. Yeah, okay. What's his name? I, it'll hit me and then I'll like spit it out, but Oops. we have yeah. purple elf that you don't. Let's, let's like speed it up a little here. All right, anyways. <laughs> okay. Thank Any, you. Anything else? I just disturb your flow. Bye guys. Bye guys. No, no, no. You did not disturb. Ah, whatever. I know how you are with your colors. Always edgy. Always yeah. finger on the button. Cut finger. you off. Yep. Let's like that. <laughs> she was such a nice I've girl. got the power. <laughs> and it's, I'm telling you, men and power, that's, yeah. that's what it's coming down to. Yeah, so um, I got another phone call. Hey, what's up, subculture? Hey, Lou, I just want to apologize for it. You know, you can come to dinner anytime you want. I'll bonus you in. You know what I'm saying? It's Ooh. Ronnie. Yeah, Ronnie. you know, I just want to hear, you know, the best thing about Canada, and I'd like you guys to discuss this for a little while, you can't do that on television. A popular 1980s yeah, Nickelodeon that was good. That, show. That, that, Thank that, you, that, Ronnie. Okay? That was the compliment of Dukes of Hazard in my youth. Thank you, but Ronnie. You can't do, and, like, maybe you guys can incorporate some of that into your show. Like, you guys could have slime and stuff. Some slime. We need some slime. Well, I mean, he's not wearing know. green. He doesn't need yeah, any more I slime. I don't know. Yeah, it, where's water the slime? Was, I don't know was slime, and water was water. Yeah. Water? What, where is it? I thought this was the introduction to the opposites. Remember that? Yeah. Uh, no, that's only on Wednesdays, my dear. Okay. Anyway, but I'd like you guys to discuss, like, American like Canadian that. politics, because I think, farce, like, Blue farce. feels really strong, strongly about the red, white, and blue, and Natasha feels really strongly about what's maple leaf, bake, bacon, whatever. So, uh, you know, you guys could talk about it. 
You just want us to fight, don't you? No, no, I don't want to You, you, you want to see me kick Lou's butt. I like to see you get fired up, you know, because I know you feel very strongly about Canada and your Maple yeah. Leafs and your Canadians and, you know, yeah, and Calgary Stampede. And I know Lou's a good old all-American boy. You know, you look at him, you know? Yeah. So I like to see you guys argue about what's closest to your heart. Tell us, tell, tell us all the bad things. Do you know we invaded Canada 13 times? With... <laughs> you know okay, what I... enough about... America invading Canada. Thank you, Ronnie. I did not mean to cut you off, but you know I'm very sensitive about these issues. The, I don't want you corrupting our the public. The Canadian dollar has been taking a big hit in the world marketplace lately. Yeah, but as soon as America <laughs> goes into a recession, we're going to be all good. It's a phone call. What's up, subculture? Hello? Hello. Hola. Hey, subculture. Yeah, what's up? Hey, what happened to Paige and Ross? <laughs> Where are they? They were much better than you guys. First it's Harley and Dave, and then it's Paige and Ross. That guy's drunk. He doesn't know what he's talking about. He I must know. be from IC. Must, IK, IK, my dear. IK. Oh, no, I'm sorry, your content's all wrong. Hey, what's up? Oh, am I on TV? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> that was great. Another one of the uh, rocket scientists out there. Another phone call. Hey, what's up, subculture? Hi, do you have any videos about Menudo? Yes. You do? Can you play yeah. it? Yes. Menudo. Who's Menudo? <laughs> you don't, oh, you were in America. <laughs> we're just joking. We have no... Hey, what's up, subculture? Hey, Paige and Ross. <laughs> <laughs> what's up, subculture? Um, okay, then. You hang up on us. This is good. <laughs> Phone call. What's up, subculture? Oh, uh, yeah. What is your show about? It's really about what you want, it to, you want it, us to make it about. It's about... What do you want to talk about? Ithaca, uh, and video. Kitty porn? Kitty porn? Kitty porn. Kitty porn. The man wants to talk about kitty porn. I don't know. Um, I don't I'm, know I'm not really up to, I'm, I'm, I don't know. I don't think so. Anna Kornikova is close as we get to kitties. And yeah, I want to I'm consider sorry. her a kitty. We, we don't cross that yeah. lower than 17th threshold. I know. It's kind of, yeah, we're like upstate New York, maybe like, you know, it's just like Arkansas in some many respects. Oh, phone call. Hey, what's up, subculture? Uh, hi, Paige. I'd like to ask you a question. What a Already. jackass. <laughs> hi, Paige. <laughs> I'm not a smart man. Let me call a TV show, and I can be funny, and people will <laughs> laugh at me. Oh, yeah. Hello. Uh, do you have anything about Brandy or Monica? Because they are the bomb. Monica Lewinsky? No, like... No, like... Mo like the other Monica. <laughs> do we do that? Do we do I think we should... Are oh. we going to a video? Wait, phone call? Hello? Time video. for a video. Video! Oh. We're going to watch a video. Video. All right. What are we going to watch? I don't know. All right, all right. Hit it. I think is it sound? No, I don't know what it is, so I'm not going to say anything. Maybe it's so much. Up. That was an interesting band name, that to was. say the least. Hey, Lou. Hey, what's up, Kev? Yeah, um, I wanted to ask you, just now you were going to say something about Daisy Duke. You didn't finish. I, I want to know Daisy what you Duke wanted to say about her. Daisy Duke is the best piece of ass on TV in the early 80s. 
Oh, wow. That's because she showed her, like, revealed her whole art. Yeah. I'm even, sure if even her Smurfette cousin... took off her skirt, she'd be the best piece of art. No. Even her cousins, like, want her. Bo and Luke. How about... Bo and how, even... how about Sable? Sable's pretty good looking. <laughs> yeah. Uh, they're competing against us in the same time slot, though, so I don't want to talk about the WWF too much, because we're going to detract many viewers. Okay, you just did that. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, I know. It's on Oops. Channel 22. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> it was a caller. <laughs> Call back. Please. Call back now. Anyways, um, I like wrestling. It's, it's good. Replied, but um, it, they'll, they'll repeat it on Saturday. Oh, you know what I watched this weekend? Oh, another call. Phone call. Hey, what's up? What's up? Yeah, how's it going? Not hey. too bad. Who is this? Uh, it's it, yeah, Bill. Hi, Bill. What's up? Nothing. Bill. So do you have, um, I, I was thinking about Boss Hog. Mm -hmm. I think he's a metaphor for Spanish drug dealers. What do you think about that? Discuss. So? Discuss. Please, please, um, I'm lost there. please elaborate. You know, you lost well, you know, the white suit, cocaine. I think he's, uh, um, I wouldn't say that. He's just fat and greedy. Maybe he's a... Who's he talking about? Boss Hog. No. You say you watch the Deuce of Hazzard. Yes, you know, but I don't remember Deuce anything. Deuce of Hazzard is my favorite show next to Different Strokes. How do you, how can you remember anything from, like, that far away What you talking about, Bill? <laughs> what you talking about, Willis? <laughs> I gotta go. All right. <laughs> I would never that say Boss Hog. That was only a little hog. inappropriate. Yeah. Just a that little. was a good show. Boss Hog is a big fat guy who wore a white suit and hat. Roscoe was a little henchman. Oh. Yeah. Enos. Oh. Oh, another call. Hello. Hello. What are your subculture? Uh, hi, Paige. Did you lose any weight? Cause you look a lot different. Um, the the <laughs> home for the mentally retarded is on after this show, so ah. um, maybe he wants to call back later. I don't um, know. <laughs> Whatever. Anyways, yeah. you were saying something. Oh, never mind. Oh, another call. Sub hey, culture. how you doing, guys? Hey, what's up? Hey, uh, I was just watching the show. I think you guys got a great show here. Thank Thanks. you. Yeah, I like uh, your videos. Cool. Yeah, Natasha, have I seen you before? I, I think so. Really? Yes. I have no idea who the hell this is. Who do you? I do. You do? I, oh, I guess. What's my name? All right, keep talking. I don't know who you are. Just Wait. say who you are and speed it up a little. Right, okay. Right, I know who you are. <laughs> who is this? You're Forrest Gump, right? Because you're an idiot, right? Oh, <laughs> oh, oh that sounds was so funny. I swear to God, these people have to like warn we us before like, they make jokes. We came oh. into like the least common denominator. Hello. I don't know. What's up? Hi. 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 I was wondering, um, Halloween's coming up soon. What are you guys gonna dress up as? Oh, Halloween. I mean. I don't know. I'm going to dress up like a pimp. I could go as your whore. Yeah. You want to do that? Yeah. I I'm planning on letting my roommates, Amy and Marcy, be my whores also. Hey, I can do that. <laughs> you so you mean you're saying that I can be your whore? Oh, is this my roommate? <laughs> yes. Oops. Oh, this is exciting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Yeah, like, you know, we can all go together. Yeah. I've got some fishnets. You could be like uh, my posse, and I could be your pimp. Mm -hmm. and, uh, you what guys exactly are you going to be wearing? Me? Or not wearing, huh? Yeah, Liz. I'm going to be wearing, like, a pimp outfit, like a sport. We're going to get some tight pants yeah. and open shirts and gold and a long yeah, trench. Yeah, I need some gold and some, some like, And a hat. Do you, hat. do you still have your condom rose to yeah, wear? I think I have that. Um, what? You're confusing <laughs> us, Mr. Producer. Anyways. Um, cool. Oh, he's gonna, you're going to wear um, lipstick. Yeah, lipstick? I should wear Nail some. polish. Oh, <laughs> nail polish. Uh, nail polish. You'll wear do pimps blue... wear nail polish? Yeah, I think they're into the blue. Uh, okay, that's a good idea. Yeah. Okay. Other than that, I'll go as um, Captain Lou Albano, you know, the famous wrestling manager. Right. What's your obsession? Captain Lou is the man. Whatever happens to dog, Lou, Lou Dog, like Dog Lou. Lou Dog? Okay, Lou. It was just, uh... I think Lulu is better, like from... <laughs> That's so cute. Lulu from Dukes Lulu. of Hazzard. Yeah, people, like tell me I, people tell me I remind them of Enos for some reason. <laughs> you know, Enos, the dipstick sheriff, not the, the deputy. The deputy. Yeah, Enos is cool. But any other, to any other topics like of cool. conversation? Um, I guess you can talk about how you're, you know, you guys are really cool. I think you're cooler than some of these other hosts. Are we cooler than uh, Paige and Ross and Harley yeah. and the other one? Yeah, I think you guys are awesome. Thank you. Oh, I'm the king. Goodbye. Um, okay. the king. Thank you. We're the king and queen that was of very nice. public access television. Somebody yeah. loves us out there. Somebody. Usually the people I... who like us are like the quiet people who just sit back and enjoy the show. Mm -hmm. The people who don't like us, like the 1% out there, like, we need to call Oh, like up. another call. Like, hello. Hey, what's up? Uh, do you have any videos by Boys to Men? By Boys to Men or yeah. about Boys to Men? 
Do you have any other top that top is a conversation besides videos? What do you think of Hunter Rawlings? <laughs> I made one million. one million by age twenty five. Five women in five countries. What was that? I don't know. I don't know. The producer's like nothing. That's like oh, another call. Hey, what's up, subculture? Hello, am I on TV? Maybe. No, yes. oh, I got a question. I got two friends here who want to freestyle rap on TV. Is that a possibility? Who want to what? Well, freestyle rap on TV. Uh, it's like the gong show. Right, we'll, let, we'll let you guys go, and if you guys suck, we're going to hang up on you. Okay, that's cool, that's cool. Go. Gonna like the gong show. Yeah, hold on one second. Here All right, is. let's go. I'm like this when you grab your head to the lyrics I write when I grab my leg. Pilot pencil too, super acid. He's talking about grabbing his leg. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, sweetheart. You have some, like, gong. The Gong Show is a great show. It is. Oh, another call. What's up, subculture? Uh, I thought those rappers sucked. Yeah, we're with you. Yeah, they like they don't even got any rhythm. You know what I'm saying? You know they're not like um the Fat Boys. The Fat Boys had rhythm. Oh my God! <laughs> no, the Beastie Boys. Did Beastie you watch that Boys? Yeah. No, I like the Fat Boys yeah. better. They got more meat. Yeah. Check All checker the and the Fat no Boys. Fun. Okay, no, you ever see that movie with the fat boys? Yes. The no, yes. but I want to see it because it's like a, it's on video. Like I want to rent it it's and like, use it in private. You know what I'm greatest, saying? It's the greatest. It's the greatest movie ever made. This really? Is who's in it boys. besides the fat boys? I think that's it. Yeah. All right. Yeah, it is by far one of the greatest movies ever made. Except for the Dukes of Hazard reunion show. That was. I did not good. see that. That was really good. I did not see. Yeah, Boss Hog was dead though, so he wasn't in it. Oh, another call. Hello. Uh, yes, have you guys been watching the performance of Sin Mutual Funds? Because I've been thinking about investing, and they went up 13% yesterday. Yes. Okay. I'd suggest investing in some pork, some pork and some Cuban cigars. You can do a lot of that stuff. Yeah. Yep. One more phone call, then we got to go to video. Hey, what's up, subculture? Hello. 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 And we got, uh, you know those people that were just freestyle rapping on your show just now? Uh-huh. Yeah. We got some more people, and we think they're going to... All right, it's time for a video. All right, let's go to a video. Thank you, Lou. Seven two three eight three five. Give us a call. What, what, what was that? <laughs> oh, we got a phone, phone call. call. Hello. Hi, this is friend Russia. Uh, <laughs> Who is that? Who are these people? I don't know. What? I think what? This this combination. We get we're, we're getting all calls. the psychos. Oh, we got another phone call. Hello. Yeah, I had a quick comment and a question. Uh -oh. yeah, um, a you guys suck. Where the hell is Harley? Harley. Alrighty then. Yeah, um, some people just don't know good TV when they see it. Um, I'm telling you. It's I know, I watched 
the few past few weeks. I don't want to diss on the last few hosts, but oh, here we they go. were kind of like only to a few people. Do some rapping too. Hello? Hello. Yes. What's up? I want to rap too. All right, let's hear it. It's like the gong show. Let's go. <laughs> now, this is a story of about how my life got... You got to make it up yourself. Yeah, you got to be I like, mean, my Yo, seven-year-old my name is like, dog knows I'm a how funky to like... Jew. <laughs> I like the color blue. <laughs> What's up with you? Um, that, that was beautiful, Lou. That, that, you know, you would have done really well. Oh, there's something great to talk about. The stupid concert. Oh, but another call. Hello. Oh. Yes, hello. This is God. How are you doing? This message is for Nick. If you don't bring back Holly and Dave, I'll spike you. All right. That was not funny. Um, uh. Yeah, people think they're funny. I guess if, I don't want to, like, I've seen the show the past few weeks. Like, I think we're equally or better than... I don't want this oh, the other another host, call. but... Hello. Hi, right, it's Bill Clinton again. Hi, oh, hey, Bill. How's though? it going? I just have to say that I don't know what's going on in Ithaca, but the morals of these people are absolutely disgusting. Oh, how so, Bill? Well, I just hear all these talk about all this rapping and everything. The influence it's having on our culture is just absolutely horrifying. Yeah, think and I think that you're the purveyors of this absolute filth. Purveyors? I like country music. You do? We're all about country. Hazard. You know, I, I'm in the process of recording my own country album. Ooh, could you give us a sample? Well, excuse me? Can you give us a little sample of this? A little record? taste, a little yeah, taste. A little taste, a little snippet. Well, one of the songs is called Open Up My Mouth and Open Up My Heart. Well, let's hear it. Well, I haven't written the lyrics yet, but it involves a tryst I had with Ms. Monica Lewinsky. But it's very painful to go into right now. How, how, many, how many women have you slept with, Bill? How many? Uh, well, you know that riddle about how many, uh, what's the difference between Bill Clinton and the Titanic? No, no. And you know that more women went down on, on the Titanic, uh, more women went down on me than on the Titanic? <laughs> very true. Bill, uh, that's beautiful. That's, that's very is. nice of you to be so open with us. Unfortunately, I think half of those women were your cousins, weren't they? Hey, we didn't, we, didn't, we didn't ask about the family associations. We don't need to know. We just wanted numbers. I'm sorry, but Bill. you know what? I voted for you in 96. Yes. Natasha. Yes, sir. I'd like you to be my next intern in the White House. I think you should take it. The I, I don't know. I mean, maybe you can give us a call after the show's over. We can work something out. Oh, I'd love that, honey bunch. All righty. I'll talk to you later. Thank you. Bye. Uh, wow. Lucky he didn't offer me an internship. Me and Bill. I'd have a little skill back. I'm, I'm sure he's just going to ask me to refer it to you. Hey, what's up, subculture? Uh, hey, Ross. How come you're acting all sub... Okay, um, there are a lot right, of jackasses like... out in the audience today. Is, 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 is Ross white? I think Ross is, um, he's, he's like, uh, I don't know. He's a retard. No, like, if, <laughs> if, if Ross, like, is white, and then this guy thinks that you look like Ross, and, like, every other man who has called, notice how no women have called asking for you to be Ross. Hey, what's up, subculture? Hey, what's going on, man? Uh, first things first, I think you guys are doing a great job. Thank you. Uh, handling the pressure of just uh, these moronic callers, but I'd like to talk about a more serious issue, if that's all right. Is that possible? That's possible. Yeah, um, through my age from 7 to 15, I had a serious cocaine addiction. Uh-huh. And I'd just like to say that a lot of kids here are doing, you know, they're blowing coke and whatnot, or doing their crazy drugs at pod, you know. Is this, um, is this Lawrence First, Taylor on the phone? But I just, I just like to say that it, it is possible to get over your addiction. And I do believe, and I just want to give a big shout out to Tank and fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> he got us good, didn't he? Oh, what yeah. a jackass. All righty. Lawrence well, Taylor understand. on the phone there. Lawrence Taylor. Why, why are we Florida. getting all these losers? I mean, not to, like, offense any of the people who, like, were very nice. I think it's um, time for a video. video. Yep. V-I-D-E-O. All right. Yep, we got some what? pathetic what? callers out there tonight. Yeah, we call them. Peaches. I'm moving to the country, I'm gonna eat me a lot of peaches. I'm moving to the country, I'm gonna eat a lot of peaches. I'm moving to the country, I'm gonna eat a lot of peaches. Peaches come from a can, they were put there by a man. Moving to the country, I'm gonna eat a lot of peaches. I'm moving to the country, I'm gonna eat a lot of peaches. I'm moving to the country, I'm gonna eat a lot of peaches. I'm moving to the country, I'm gonna eat a lot of peaches. I'
country I'm gonna eat a lot of peaches I'm moving to the country I'm gonna eat a lot of peaches I'm moving to the country gonna eat a lot of peaches I'm moving to the country gonna eat a lot of peaches I took a little nap with a little soul twist squished your rotten peach in my fist and dreamed about you a woman you like to talk about today? How about um, all that jackasses that have been calling in, asking I'm for like Paige you. and Ross, and like, I get to curse on public access TV. Look how cool I am. I tricked the host. I'm so funny. Ha, ha, ha. You know, we have all those jackasses out there tonight calling in. Probably on a normal call. Amy, how's it, how's it going? It, it's going good. How about you? It's going okay, but you know, as I said, we have too many um, jackasses I out didn't there. even know that there were that many on campus, but we found them all, that's for sure. Yeah, they're Woo. all tuning in tonight. You know. All right, so you know, I heard that my roommate wants me to be his whore. Oh, <laughs> that's cool. You should let him do it. Who, who, who's your roommate again, Amy? For all those people who didn't hear it the first time. I don't know. I think it's some guy named Lou. Lou. Like Lou, Lou Dog or Captain Lou. Something like that. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Lou, Lou, that's not proper. You know, you don't ask a woman to be your whore. That's that's just presumptuous. You know. Yeah. This is this is the problem with with men these days. Yeah. They're all about being presumptuous. I Am know. I right, Amy? Uh, yeah, definitely. Uh, see? Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I was a bad, bad boy. <laughs> we gotta thank you, Lou. <laughs> no, yeah. let's not go there. Cool. <laughs> so Anyways. Are, are Kevin and Marcy still there? Marcy's not here. Where's Kevin? He's here. Does he have anything interesting to talk about? Kevin, yeah. Not that one. How many yeah. do you have in this apartment? Like five. It's <laughs> ridiculous. You can talk to Mike. Mike, who did? We have a good. Oh, this somebody just pick something to talk about because we're running out of time here. Yeah. Quick, quick, quick. One more minute. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna so hang up on you. Tell me about that run the Jets against San Francisco. Your thoughts on that game? Um, there was a holding on that play, and that uh, should have been called back. Uh, like, I was watching this show yesterday, they, the, a bunch of columnists talked about how that was the greatest rush of all time. Yeah. Well, it was holding on that play, so it probably shouldn't be. You know, Jets are in good position for a playoff, so, so it's all working out in the end. They beat the Patsies really bad last week. Uh, my team's in good position to clean up next year. Yeah. When we revamp our whole team, when we fire our idiot coach. Are you the Cleveland Browns? <laughs> Cleveland Browns got the top pick next year. Yeah, I know that. <laughs> But the skins are going for number two and number three, baby. 
Ooh, yeah. All you retards out there like Paige and Ross, I don't care. Like, you guys are just sitting around with your pants around your ankles hoping that Paige will lift her shirt up. That's all you guys were doing all last year. So just, like, pull up your pants and start watching the skins. We're going to start improving from here on out. Yeah. Yeah, you guys are the bomb. Yeah. <laughs> he knows what he's talking about. That's a I, smart guy. That whole conversation Paige and Ross me. were just like for uh, male viewers. You know, those are all the calls are guys. I think Paige had huge knockers or something, so everybody I, I used to watch. I don't know. I never saw I never saw. I never saw her, but 30 right. seconds, one more, one more call. call. What's up? Hello, subculture. Hey, hey yo, why you guys can be racial and stuff, man? Yeah. Who's being racial? So some guy called up and he's like, Ross is a white guy. Um, Who are these people? Where did they find know. us? Phone call? What? No. 15, 15 seconds. seconds. Time. No, I just, I don't know. I'm just sorry that there's so many losers out there. The final countdown. You ready? Okay, Mary. Goodbye. The final. Big man on campus this week. Donate money at all the little stands around campus.